A Marine cor corporal and recruiter in Grand Rapids could face up to life in prison after police say he entered a Plainfield Township home over the weekend and repeatedly stabbed an 11 year old girl. News 8's Byron Tollefson is live outside the 63rd District Courthouse where his arraignment just wrapped up. Byron? Emily and Rick, we should warn you all that the details in this story are very disturbing. According to court documents, 24-year-old Ricardo Castillo admitted that his intent was to break into that home and kill the entire family. According to court documents here, for the last nine months, Castillo has been a recruiter for the Marine Corps in Grand Rapids. This afternoon, he was arraigned on several felony charges, including assault with intent to murder, first-degree home invasion, and assault with intent to commit criminal sexual conduct. Bond was set at $2 million cash. Around 3 o'clock Saturday morning in a home on Ella Terrace Court in Plainfield Township, deputies say that Castillo entered the house and found two girls sleeping. They say he repeatedly stabbed an 11-year-old girl in her left arm and her shoulder, causing her to need surgery. The victim was reportedly friends with the other girl and was staying the night at her house for a sleepover. The homeowner, her friend's father, reportedly confronted the Marine and held him at gunpoint until deputies arrived and arrested him. Law enforcement believes the home was unlocked. The girl was hospitalized for her injuries and she was last listed in stable condition. The sheriff's office said Saturday morning that this attack appeared to have been completely random, but a source tells News 8 that aspect of the case remains under investigation. Here's what Judge Sarah Smolensky told the Marine this afternoon. This is as big as it gets. This case, it's as scary as it gets. It's as horrific as it gets. And it puts all of us in a fear zone like no other. Coming up at 5, we'll take a look at Castillo's history with the Marines. For now, live in Grand Rapids Township, Byron Tollefson, News 8.